What is up guys, Killer Kevin today back with a brand new episode of Skyrim Special Edition Mod Showcases on my channel. Hopefully you guys are having a super sick day and today we are going to be covering throwing weapons. This is absolutely beautiful. Cannot wait to show you this guys. Thank you ever so much for the person on the screen now. Thank you very much for suggesting this and we are going to dive straight into it. So as always guys, if you want this mod, links are down in the description. And uh, I personally would grab this one just to try it out. I'm very interested in seeing the mechanics work and everything else. And what I've done is I've downloaded the mod and I went over to the sort of forge section and I went to the misc section of the forge, which is the bottom section of the forge, and crafted a ton of different throwing materials. We've got throwing knives, throwing axe, and javelins. Also as well, there's an oil pot, there's frost poison grenades, smoke bombs, and grenades, but I'm only gonna be showing a few off here just because I wanna see the mechanics as they are for the actual weapons so that will be throwing knives, axes and javelins. Those three we're going to be showcasing in this video. Obviously, if you want to see the, any other three, so that is the frost poison grenade and the smoke bombs with also the standard grenades, then uh, grab this mod yourself and try it out. But I just wanted to see these three in particular and see the, how they actually worked because I know for a fact I'm running a few different other animation mods in conjunction with this one. I want to see if it tinkers or changes anything to do with that. So I'm here at the back of white run we've got some test dummies here and we got some target ranges as well so i want to check all this out in conjunction with the throwing weapon so let's start off with some throwing axes as you can tell here throwing axes do the most damage they fly the shortest distance and have a medium throwing speed weight is five and uh they're, they're pretty good they obviously are very op when they hit as well so yeah, these are pretty good. I'm not too sure if you can upgrade these on the grindstone. I really am not too sure because obviously they work as an ammo kind of factor here. So uh, yeah, you get 12 per craft. So uh, let's have a little look. This is what they look like as here. Have a quick look at the animation as well. So this is one of the throwing axes. A little bit of a an awkward throw there. I might be aiming at the ground though. I'm not too sure I am aiming at the ground. So let's obviously have a better little look here. Let's go back into that camera angle. This is me throwing them. Again, there doesn't seem to be any issue. I'm running a sort of different set of, um, that's really cool actually, a different set of animations entirely from the vanilla one. So obviously yours won't look this derpy, but the fact of that they are working this well is pretty damn cool. They look great in this view. See if we can get one on the board there. Yeah, we can. Sweet. Let's go for a bullseye of some sort. Oh, there we go. Boom. What's that like? Let's have a little look. Oh, it's in the actual board itself. That's really good. So obviously these do the most amount of damage. You've got to remember that. And obviously the shortest distance too. Obviously going to try these out in combat as well near the end of the video. But I just want to see what the animation was like. They're pretty weird when they roll as well. Oh, that one missed it completely. I love how they stick into things as well, and the fact that they can differentiate between an actual object and like a wall, for instance. These are the throwing knives. A little bit different on these ones, but they still look great. Oh, they're great. So throwing knives are the fastest to throw. They do weak damage and fly at medium distance as well. The weight of these is one, and the likelihood of them hitting something is pretty damn good. Add is damage when it's sneak attack too. So obviously if you're pretty sneaky and uh, you got to a real good aim then uh, you are pretty much on point now what I'm gonna do is actually turn this setting on here my HUD didn't realize I had it off until now but I want to see how fairly accurate these things are love how the what? grips it as well slightly missed but we are throwing with our right hand so you kind of have to compensate for the fact of that but no overall they, they're, they're really good I really enjoy this I love the fact that the mechanics as well are slightly different as usual but you have to compensate it isn't direct, which I kind of like at the same time because obviously the crosshair in the middle is technically your eyes and uh, your eyes wouldn't follow up on that. So the fact that it flows from the right hand is great. Now I wonder if this can be placed with two hands. Can this be... No, it's one at a time. Ah, oh, that's unfortunate. You can't have one in the other hand. No worries about that. Let's have a look at the javelin as well. This one's presented slightly different. It's obviously ammo on the back as well. Compensates on the right as well. Pretty damn good. So the javelins, these fly the furthest. Do moderate damage as well, but they have a slow throwing speed. The weight is nine of these. So uh, yeah, 
I, I like the javelin. I love the animation as well. I think they fly out. I wonder how far this actually goes. There you go. Over the wall. Don't know if you guys could have seen that. Um, kind of want to throw one in town, but I don't want to kind of... Let's try and aim for that up there. Oh. That went over. Whoopsie. What about that? I think that just stuck in his mouth, actually. But I'm going to have a quick look in a minute. I'm going to keep throwing those up there. That's really cool, though. I love the mechanic of that. That's absolutely great. I really do like this. This is an absolute great mod. I'm not going to lie. There's just so much diversity to it. And for the fact that, as well, I'm running a custom set of animations to do with combat, it works really well with it as well. It's just really fun. Javelins are by far my favourite, just because they sort of flow slightly quicker than the other ones as well, and they're a lot more straighter. But uh, I really want to try it on her. Should we just try it on her? Miss. Straighter. Oh! Shit, there we go. Damn, they do a moderate amount of damage. I wonder what throwing axes do. Well, I'm officially a murderer. Where did that actually get her? Right in the neck. Let's pull her out a little bit. <laughs> Have a little look. Smack bang in the neck. That's a trick shot, boys and girls. And that was an absolute beautiful shot too. Guys, if you did enjoy this mod showcase, let me know with a like and a comment. I think this one's absolutely great. Thank you ever so much for suggesting me. Uh, guys, you need to try out the poison frost grenades, smoke bombs, and grenades itself. That is going to be absolutely mad. Wow. That's great. And they look great as well. They don't look really naffy, which is kind of cool. I wonder if she has the javelin in her. Nah, she doesn't. Well, rip her. Oh well, no one, no one saw anything, so I'm just going to carry on. But thanks ever so much for watching, guys. This has been Killer Kev, and get a Kev out.